children find their way to a good daycare program. Joining me is Dagmara Antkevich, and she is with Red Caboose. I want to just say about this person before you hear what she does for this group. She's a volunteer, and she came back from camping just to be here for NBC 15 News at 11. Uh, this is a really neat program that I just heard about, Red Caboose. Uh, what you do is you help low-income families find their way to good daycare for their children. Correct. Tell me a little bit more about what's coming up. What is it, next weekend? No, this? Yes, this next weekend. Next July weekend, 13th. okay. So one of the ways uh, we try to raise money for low-income uh, families to basically provide them with additional funds um, so that they can afford the full-time, good quality uh, daycare at Red Caboose Nature mm -hmm. uh, Center. Um, we have several different ways of raising money, but one of the ways that we try to do it is this uh, fun Move Your Caboose um, run, walk. run Walk. So it's a really short thing, and it's right in the neighborhood, um, in the Willie Street, Williamson, Marquette mm -hmm. neighborhood. It's along the lake, and um, it's happening at 8.30 on July 13th. And you can walk with your child in a stroller, or you can run. Um, we have prizes for three top uh, runners. Uh, female and male. And you also have a really fun course for the little ones to go yes, through. Yes, we do have something for children to do if they're not in a stroller or not walking with their parents. They can either um, go and have fun in a bouncy house mm -hmm. or uh, you can enroll them in the uh, Kids Challenge which will happen at 9.45 uh, and it's a about half an hour shorter thing and they have an obstacle course and kind of different games and everybody gets a prize of See some that's sort. perfect. So they now, just have fun. And it is very important to mention that Red Caboose it's nonprofit. Correct. And really tell me why parents depend on Red Caboose. What's the ultimate benefit? Well, for me personally, ultimate benefit is having my child in the care where she really feels loved and appreciated and um, feels at home mm -hmm. to the point that I can't get her out of there. And uh, then you can go and, and go. I can go and have my career or mm -hmm. you can go and take classes and for their education and for low income families especially or single parents, that's the only way where you can uh, develop yourself, either your career or education and better yourself and kind of get out of the, the poverty or low income if you can, um, you know, rely on good child care to be sure that your child is in good hands mm -hmm. while you go and do that, and you can afford it. Doug Mara, thank you so much. If you would like more information on the July 13th 5K Run Walk, it is Saturday, July 13th at Marquette Elementary School. Correct. Just go to NBC15.com and click on news links. Thank you so much for thank sharing you. your story thank and you being very honest about that and coming back from your campsite. Go yes. back, go camp, and enjoy I the rest. Will. I will.